Today's Flash Briefing is brought to you by Power Credit Union, proudly serving Southern Colorado. Visit a location today and be empowered. I'm Renee Skinner with this News 5 update. Governor Jared Polis issuing an executive order to help Colorado families who have had their finances upended by the pandemic. The order will expedite state unemployment claims, defer state personal and business income tax payments to July 1st, allow consumers to defer loan payments without penalty and prevent mortgage foreclosures. The governor says the state is also creating an emergency economic council to help Colorado get through the recession. And the state attorney general, Phil Weiser, calling for a statewide pause on eviction proceedings. In a statement, Weiser said evicting Coloradans from their homes would make the current public health and economic crisis worse. He thanked courts in Denver as well as Mesa, Weld and Boulder counties, which have already suspended or postponed eviction proceedings. And he urged all other state courts to do the same. Here's meteorologist Sam Schreier with a check on our forecast. Sam? We are talking about fire advisories, red flag warnings in effect through Pueblo, Huerfano County, Los Animas County, Crowley to Otero County. We are expecting easily spread fires if they were to start because the humidity would be low and the winds would be strong. So we hope that doesn't happen. If you see smoke, call it in. Forecast highs are in the 50s from Colorado Springs to Pueblo and through the plains. So some very nice stuff coming our way through the afternoon temperature wise. But again, it comes with high fire danger. Lows tonight are going to be down into the 30s. So that's something we need to keep our eyes out for. Over the next seven days, here is the setup. We're going to go from the 50s to the 60s to the 70s, and then we kick it back into the Friday, Saturday, 50, 40 degree range with snow a little bit more likely towards the end of the week, especially over the mountains in the Pikes Peak region. But we'll have that as we go through time. Thank you for listening to today's News 5 Flash Briefing, sponsored by Power Credit Union.